Hello everyone, welcome to yet another funtechtips.com video where I'm going to show you how you can warp text using GIMP. To do this we're going to use the caged transform tool which was introduced in GIMP 2.8 I think. Uh, first we're going to create a new image of course and we're going to write up some text. going to increase the font size so that it's more easier to see and we're going to align it to center but you don't have to do this of course now what we're going to do next is Im important because otherwise when you use the cage transform tool the text is going to be cut you need to increase the boundary of the text layer to do this, when you have the text layer selected, you go into layer, layer boundary size. Here, you now need to increase the size of the boundary size. You can see in the preview area here that it's in increasing. Increase both width and height. And then use this positioning tool and or you just you, or you can just use the center button to center the text click resize and you can see that the boundary size has now increased around the text next we're going to draw out the cage with which, with which we're going to warp the text this doesn't matter what size it is the closer you put it to text though you'll be able to pull it more out outwards the only thing that you have to do now when you close the loop the circle is to pull on these transform points and as you can see the text is being warped make sure that when you warp you don't go too far because text will go outside of the boundary size and it will disappear if you want to go even further you'll have to increase the boundary size and that's it if you have an easier way of how to do this or any suggestions, put it in the comment section below. Thanks.